We can use special triangles to get exact values for sine, cosine, and tangent of some special angles. For example, this is a 45-45-90 triangle. If we set each leg as a length of 1, Pythagoras tells us that the hypotenuse will have a length of the square root of 2. We'll take one of the 45 degree angles. 45 degrees is 45 times pi over 180, or pi over 4 radians. The sine of 45 degrees is the opposite side over the hypotenuse, which is 1 over the square root of 2. And rationalizing the denominator gives us root 2 over 2 as the exact sine of 45 degrees. The cosine of 45 degrees is the adjacent side over the hypotenuse, which is 1 over root 2. And rationalizing the denominator gives us root 2 over 2, so the exact cosine of 45 degrees is root 2 over 2. The tangent of 45 degrees is the opposite side over the adjacent side, which is 1 over 1, or 1. So the exact tangent of 45 degrees is 1. To summarize, these are the exact values for the sine, cosine, and tangent of 45 degrees, or pi over 4 radians. Now we'll look at the 30, 60, 90 triangle. For a triangle with these angles, if we set the length of the shorter leg as 1, the length of the longer leg is the square root of 3, and the length of the hypotenuse is 2. These are exact values. First we'll consider the 30 degree angle. 30 degrees is 30 times pi over 180, or pi over 6 radians. The sine of 30 degrees is the opposite side over the hypotenuse, which is 1 over 2, or exactly 1 half. The cosine of 30 degrees is the adjacent side over the hypotenuse, which is the square root of 3 over 2. So the exact cosine of 30 degrees is root 3 over 2. The tangent of 30 degrees is the opposite side over the adjacent side, which is 1 over the square root of 3. And rationalizing the denominator gives us root 3 over 3, which is the exact value of the tangent of 30 degrees. To summarize, these are the exact values for the sine, cosine, and tangent of 30 degrees, or pi over 6 radians. Now we'll consider the 60 degree angle. 60 degrees is 60 times pi over 180, or pi over 3, radians. The sine of 60 degrees is the opposite side over the hypotenuse, which is the square root of 3 over 2. So the exact sine of 60 degrees is root 3 over 2. The cosine of 60 degrees is the adjacent side over the hypotenuse, which is 1 over 2. So the exact cosine of 60 degrees is 1 half. The tangent of 60 degrees is the opposite side over the adjacent side, which is root 3 over 1. So the exact value for the tangent of 60 degrees is the square root of 3. In summary, these are the exact values for the sine, cosine, and tangent of 60 degrees, or pi over 3 radians. The exact angles we considered in this video, 45 degrees, 30 degrees, and 60 degrees, are all acute angles they're less than 90 degrees. However, we know that angles above 90 degrees, exactly 90 degrees, exactly 180 degrees, and exactly zero are also possible. Some of these can have exact values for sine, cosine, and tangent. To examine these, we need a more complex model.